This video is not against Michelle D, okay? Let's go. Alright, what is up, Alex here? And yes, um, as you've seen from the thumbnail, this would be all about Michelle D's fragrances on her previous video. I guess it was three days ago from the time I'm recording this. I've seen very suspicious looking bottles in that video. Okay, and I am under, I am making this video under the presumption that she is innocent in this one, in this matter. Okay, let's start. Right now, I am viewing her video. Kung san hawak niya yung Lanva, Lanva and Ekla Darpage. And she's holding. Is there any way that I can. She's holding a violet and a green bottle. It should be just violet. I think Procter and Gamble did not release anything that is green for, for the bottle of uh, Lanvan. It is obviously a fake. There are limited editions of this. Na, I guess uh, they're pink. Ganyan. May mga comment din actually dito na. Baka nga daw na scam siya. Red or pink yung mga limited editions na tong bottle na to. Pero never that the House of Lan Vaughn has released a green one. Okay? Now, if you've seen her video. She also has. She also has some Versace bright crystal. Here, Versace bright crystal, and one glaring thing about this bottle is that the Versace nya is kule too big halos, whereas the original nito should be colored pink. It should be really bright pink. Same with the Christian Dior. The meron siya. I think that's Miss Dior absolutely blooming. And that one, yung kulay niya parang, it's really off. It's like yellow and absolutely blooming as far as I know. It's bright pink again. So the one that she's holding is kind of like yellow. It's not supposed to be like that. It's like yellow green. It's supposed to be pink if it's absolutely blooming. <sighs> Obviously, she was she was scammed by this company called Nishop Fab or what is it called? Um, Nishop Fab Onlinei. Oh God, they disrespected Michelle D big time with this one. She's one of the biggest, if not the biggest, Filipina beauty vlogger. So, to have her endorse fake, fake perfumes? Kasi lahat tong nandito sa video niya. Everything that's in here is available in the shop fab or online. Which is nasa, I think nasa Shopee. Yes, asa Shopee sila. Yan yung in-endorse na store ni Michelle D. Ito sa description niya rito. Ayan. Check out onlinee.ph on IG. So yeah, she's endorsing this. So here comes the problem with it. It does not help her credibility endorsing an online store that sells fakes. Tama mali. Now, I am presuming na Michelle does not know na yung online store na pinlag niya or in-endorse niya dito sa description box hindi niya alam na itong store na to are selling fakes which is kind of the problem here I see no reason kung ba't niya kailangan suportahan pa tong online stores na to and lahat nung, lahat nung mayroon siya I'm inclined to think nagaling to dun sa store na yon 
common sense tells us that. Now for Michelle, you have two courses of action na pwedeng gawin. Yung isa, first action that you can do is take no action at all. Deadmahin mo lang tong video, deadmahin mo tong issue na to, and lead, lead your 3.05 million subscribers into buying in that online shop that sells fix. Yun ang una. I think you need to be more responsible with this. That is why I'm suggesting the second course of action, which is to cut your ties with Onliney or Nishop Fab or any other perfume shops that sells fakes. Why? This one will hurt your credibility. You have, as far as I know, you have your own cosmetic line, right? It would be very disrespectful if someone duplicates it and, you know, fakes your products, right? Cut your ties with them, um, cut your associations with them, screen these online shops that sells perfumes na gustong magpa-endorse sa'yo. And how do you do that? How do you screen them? Okay, first one is using the internet. You can scour the internet to see which ones are legit and which ones are not. Presyo pa lang, you could see it. Second course of action is to join Facebook groups to know which of these online sellers are selling fakes and which ones are selling the authentic ones, okay? Going into these Facebook groups gets you more educated, more informed, and obviously you're, right now you're at a stage where you're still vulnerable with, with the fakes. We've been there, but through experience, naitama natin to, through experience, we, would, we now know Personally, I now know how to spot fakes, amoy pa lang, packaging and such, kulay ng juice or kulay ng fragrance. Ganon, presyo pa lang. No, so mga nagtatanong, sino ba? How, how would you know na peke yan? Okay, I have been with fragrances since my early teens up until now. I know the packaging, fragrances, how fragrances evolve, how they dissipate. How they turn through experience, through information in the internet, you know, discontinuations or formulations and such. If uh, I have been reviewing fragrances in YouTube for the last two years plus, and I have formed the biggest Facebook group here in the Philippines, and inside that group are more knowledgeable people more knowledgeable than me, more experienced than me. And yeah, that's that's the benefit of being with this fragrance uh, community. You will not get duped ever again. And yeah, I admit, I have been duped then. Nung hindi pa ako masyadong maalam sa pagbangon. Nalo ako din ako. Testers daw. Kay Amora. I mean, dalawa lang yan eh. Orig na tester. At orig na retail packaging. Dalawa lang yun. Ngayon, may mga explanation pa tong online or in the shop fab dun sa shopping nila na do not compare or test or some malls, ganyan-ganyan. Why not? They should be they should be the same. What are you scared of? What are you scared of? Presyo nyo pa lang. Online in the shop fab and other fake uh, other sellers na nagbibenta ng fake perfumes, 2,000 below lahat. Lela Bo, Tom Ford, um, may some Francis Kirk John. Really? Below 2,000? Christans is selling Baccarat Rouge 540 for around 22,000. And you're selling it for under 2,000? Are you kidding me? Online ni Shop Fab. Are you kidding me? Huwag niyo sabihin orig yan. Huwag niyo sabihin authentic testers yan. Kasi malamang nabili niyo lang yan. Mga isang libo. And kung nabili niyo na isang libo yan, sa tingin niyo, orig yan? Hmm? Huwag niyo lukuhin yung mga tao. Pinaghirapan nila yung pera nila. Tapos bibigyan mo sila ng peke. 
Moonline ni Shop Fam at iba pang mga online stores dyan na nagbibenta ng pagkain fragrances. Hindi nyo paikutin na ulo nila na tester yan kaya mura. You can get yourself uh, more informed by joining Facebook groups, international man or local. If you want to go local, I can suggest the, fa- the Facebook group that I'm in, which is Frag Revolution PH. In there, you could see the list. Or you could even ask us for the list of legitimate stores that are selling fragrances. Para next time na may magpa-endorse sa'yo, pwede mong ma-screen using us. Okay? The group would be welcoming you open arms. Lahat ng questions mo, your friends' questions about fragrances, you're welcome. We are more than welcome to give you information and to lead you dun sa mga sellers na authentic. Para hindi na ito maulit sa'yo. Kasi this is not a good look for your credibility, right? You have such a huge influence dito sa beauty industry natin, sa Philippines, sa community. You are reaching 3.05 million loyal Filipinas na who are trusting you. Please do not fail them. Don't lead them to this online stores selling fakes. Please don't. Do not be an accessory sa illegal na ginagawa nitong mga online shops na to that's that are selling fakes do not be an accessory please okay you are i'm under the presumption that you are innocent about this na they just provided you with this fragrances okay but now na alam mo na na fake yung mga binibenta nila it's about time to get mature get responsible about the content that you put out do i hate her no This is part of a learning experience. Sa fragrances, you get duped, you get faked. It's part of the learning process. And now is the proper opportunity for you to rectify this. Lead your followers on the right path. Okay? You can do this. You have the power to do this. Because as, I guess, what was that movie? Spider-Man Bayon with great power comes great responsibility. So I guess it is your responsibility to your audience, to the influenced ones, to those who look up to you, mga, mga bata, ganyan, even yung mga age mo, or whoever, Filipina, they look up to you. You don't want to be associated with fake fragrances, right? Fixing this would help your credibility. It's part of growing up, admitting your mistake, and rectifying it. There's nothing wrong with this. What's wrong, what I am against, is that online shop. Online-y. Niche shop fab. You're selling fake fragrances, for sure. That is for sure. Price nyo pa lang. And even if we test them side by side and do the progressive smelling method, top middle base, I can prove my accusations to you. Yes, you can do this side-by-side test. The one in Rustans, the legit fragrances samples that I have against yours. Man, don't scam these people. Lalo na kayo mga iba pa, hindi lang tong dalawa na to. There's a lot of online sellers. Selling by Ridos, Tom Fords, 2K, really? Online in the shop fab. It's disrespected Michelle D with this one. You have disrespected the people. You have robbed people of their cash their hard-earned cash, lalo na ngayon times. Ito na, these are trying times, man. I mean, the economy isn't doing good. And is this online store is still scamming people? Get informed. Lahat kayo makakabasa nito, please get informed. Kasi yun ang mga legit. So you don't get scammed. 
okay, do not support this online shops. Lalo na yung binabanggit kong dalawa na yan. And to end this on a lighter note, Michelle D, you have the power to turn this situation around. You have the power to influence the people for the better. Please lead them to the right store that sells authentic products, okay? This would help your credibility, admitting your mistake, being responsible about it, being informed, and then referring them to the legitimate source. And these are just my recommendations, opinions, and suggestions for Michelle D on how to fix this situation. And as always, this has been your host Alex. I'm out.